Want to start using the Files app on your iPhone, but not sure how it works? We're here to help. I'm Jessica, and this video is our beginner's guide to the Files app, where I'll teach you all the basics of managing files on your iPhone. Now let's get started. When you open up the Files app, you'll see a menu of options at the bottom. Let's go through the different tabs you'll find in the menu bar. In the Recents tab, you'll find files you've recently added or recently opened. In the Shared tab, you'll see any files or folders that have been shared with you by other users. The Browse tab holds the majority of your files. Here you can access your iCloud Drive, files stored on your iPhone, anything you've recently deleted, and files you've downloaded to your iPhone. Tap any of these categories to see files within them. You can tap a file here to open and view it. For zip folders, simply tap them once to unzip them. If you tap the three dots in the top right corner, you can choose to display your files as icons or as a list, and sort them by name, kind, date added, size, or by tags. If you hold down a file icon or list entry, you'll see a pop-up menu with additional options. Here you can copy a file to paste it into a message, email, etc. Tap Move to move this file to a different folder or location in your Files app. Tap Share to get options to share a file through AirDrop, Messages, Email, and other apps. Tap Get Info to see details about your file, including the file type, size, date created, and more. Tap Rename to change the name of your file. Tap Compress to create a zip file. Tap Duplicate to make a copy of this file within the same folder. Tap New Folder to create a new folder that contains the selected file. At the bottom, you'll see the option to delete the file. The pop up menu also has the option to add tags. Let's look at how to use these. At the bottom of the Browse menu, you'll find various tag categories. These include a range of colors, as well as work, home, and important. If you hold down one of the colored tags, you can remove or rename them. For example, maybe you want to add a tag for documents related to a certain topic or purpose. When you add this tag to a document or folder, it will make it easier to find items related to that topic or purpose. To add a tag to a document or folder, locate the item you want to add the tag to. Then hold down the icon or list item. In the pop-up menu, select Tags. Then choose the tag you want to add. Then tap Done. Now, when you choose that tag in the Browse menu, you'll see any items you've added the tag to in that section of your Files app. That does it for our beginner's guide to using the Files app on iPhone. For more helpful iPhone tips and tricks, check out our full playlist of iPhone tutorials. Click the playlist on your screen now to watch. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, we'd love it if you'd hit the like button below and subscribe to our channel. We put out great new tech tutorials like this one every day.